Hi, I'm the Calculus Professor and today we will be talking about the Fundamental Theorem of Calculus. In problem number 61, we'd like to find the derivative with respect to x of an integral. Okay, so when we're trying to find the derivative of an integral, we sometimes can use the Fundamental Theorem. Part of the Fundamental Theorem says that if I'm taking the derivative of an integral and I'm integrating from a constant to the variable that I'm taking the derivative with respect to, which is x, so if I'm integrating from a constant to x of some function dt, then what I can do is I can just replace the t's that I have in this function with x's and the job is done, okay? So what I need to do here is very simple. I'm taking the derivative of an integral. And you have to be careful here because if all the pieces don't match up, I can't use the fundamental theorem at all. So I have to make sure that I'm taking the derivative of an integral that is running from a constant up to the variable that I'm taking the derivative with respect to. If that's the case, then what the fundamental theorem tells me is just take this value x and plug it in everywhere that I have a t in my function. And so I get x squared plus x plus 1. And I'm done. 